we're going to go into the last segment of the night is next O Canada, O Canada okay. player of the week from last week. Who balled, who showed out, who did they damn the dizzle. Um, I'm going to keep it short this week. It's two Montreal players, man. Um, shout out to Roland Milligan. They can't have another interception. God damn it. Somebody stop him. What? Stop throwing him the ball. Defense I can't even say stop throwing him the ball. Defense player of the year? Defense player of the year? He might, he might be the first DB since um, that's phone here. This is my guy, phone, since Javon. Don't let phone here. This, the, you know, spoon out there hunting right now. Um, <laughs> um, player of the weeks, man. Damn, I got the wrong paper. Um, offense is Charles Rambo, six receptions, one hundred and twenty-four yards, two TDs. Big week for him. Bombed up Hamilton secondary. Mm-hmm. The young guys out there, they had a tough day with him. Dealing with him that night, he's starting to get confidence. Yeah. Um, uh, if they bring back Mac, it'll go along with him and the group that they got. So, woo, shoot. Um, on defense, I'm gonna stick with Montreal, man. This linebacker's been balling, he's been doing this thing. Both of the linebackers have been balling, but Darnell Sankey been holding down the middle for them, holding down the fort, the leader, the voice of their defense right now. He came over last year and he hasn't lost a game, I don't think, no, since he got it. there. All right, all right, yeah, yeah. so um. He has six tackles, one interception, one fumble recovery, and those are my two O Canada, O Canada players of the week, man. Um, y'all hit that follow button, like, subscribe, do what the hell you gotta do. Hit that subscribe button, man. We're trying to bring more attention to the CFL because we truly love the game. Um, we played for a while, Darby played for a while, I played for a while. And it was truly good to us. And it's just so much fun. And I don't think a lot of people understand because they don't understand the rules or they just think that's just a second tier league. But it's a really fun league, especially if you get to know the rules, you get to know the game and you watch it. You'll be like, damn, all three aspects of the game matter. Special teams is big. Offense is big. Defense is big. And you put all three together, you, you get a championship. You get a real fun game, a little different. Like special teams matters mm-hmm. like it ain't no ducking and dodging. That. It ain't no kicking it out of bounds. It ain't no, you know, yeah. it's literally, literally, even if you miss a field goal, it's, it's, it's the most exciting thing to see. And you got returners like JG, J. Janari and Grant, um, Leaks, um, Deadman in Ottawa, um, and and Alfred and, and Sass. Yep. And these guys are just made the game a whole, take it to a whole different level. Yep. So we just keep trying to keep bringing some new eyes to the league, man. The former players, man, y'all share this, man. It's for y'all. It ain't for me. I ain't playing. Shit, yep. Darby ain't playing. It's for y'all. Y'all share it. Trying to bring more attention to y'all. Hopefully that put more money in y'all pockets later on. Maybe a dollar for me. So. Uh, a little dollar or two dollar for me. I just want to go to the Grey Cup game in BC this year and, and, and be a media person. Well, that'll be lit. That'll be dope. Get uh, on there, y'all. Come on. Come on.